So it's official, uh, Derek Chisora versus Joseph Parker is officially off. Uh, that fight will not take place on the 26th of October at the O2 Arena. We're going to need to find a suitable opponent for Derek Chisora as Joseph Parker is uh, unfit to take part in this contest. Um, it's a bit of a blow as Derek was really up for the fight. He was he's looking, looking fantastic. Um, and we're going to need to now find a substitute. Lots of names have been, been chucked around. Um, to look at looking online, but um, between myself and Eddie, I believe we'll, we'll find a suitable opponent to give the fans the fight they need. We need to find someone whose style is going to gel nicely with uh, Derek Chisora. You know, it's a pay-per-view event, so it needs to be a pay-per-view worthy uh, opponent. So we're just working very hard on getting someone locked down as soon as possible. So what kind of time frame are you looking to sort of announce a new opponent for Derek for his next fight? Um, hopefully, over the next uh, three or four days, um, you know, we could have someone today agree, yes, 100%, we want to do the fight. But by the time we, if there's, let's say the guys in America with the time differences, getting his legal team to okay the contract, you know, there's a lot, a lot of back and forth needs to be done with negotiations uh, and whatnot. So realistically, I'd say, you know, it'd be less than a week. Um, we may have somebody already who's um, uh, agreed it, but there's one thing agreeing it over the phone, there's another thing agreeing it. When a contract sent to you, so um, we're, we're talking to multiple multiple parties in in the hopes that we can get someone to sign on a dotted line and get over it for an absolute barnstormer of a night. Um, how did Derek react to the news? Derek was very very upset. Obviously, he, he he's really geared himself up. He's he's training hard. He's healthy. He wants to really you know show the world what he's about. And uh, Joseph Parker, we believe, brought we bring out the very best in Derek. He's brought the best out of him in training, and we just hope that uh, you know, Joseph Park would step through those ropes to, to for Derek to prove how good he is in the ring. You know, at the O2 Arena, where he's so many times performed at, at a world level. So um, everything happens for a reason. Let's just hope we get an opponent as soon as possible that you know the fans are happy with, and not only that, that that's, that styles you know, them, you know styles make fights. They say in the in the boxing game, and we need to we need to get an opponent who's going to really sort of bring the best out in Derek and for Derek to bring the best out in whoever he fights so we're going to get an absolute um, humdinger of a fight. To be honest, Derek Chisora took the news uh, about as well as I think you can take it. He uh, was obviously upset at the time, you know, a bit frustrated, but you know, the next morning he was, he was back in the gym training hard. It hasn't slowed his, his training routine. As he knows, you know, we, we've given him a, a list of names, that are potential names, and all of those names are dangerous names. They're all world-class, recognisable, world-renowned names that he'll need to be at his best for. It's not like he's going to go from this to a, to a journey where he's going to knock over in two rounds. He knows whoever is going to be in the opposite corner for him is going to be world-class, uh, and he needs to be at his very best. So he's fought, thankfully made, um, made the adjustments mentally needed to go back into the gym. Although he doesn't have a name, a solid name to aim at, he still he knows it's a world class performance or nothing uh, will work on on the 26th of October. So October 26th, are we going to see the best Derek Chisora? I think so. I think Derek Chisora is going to bring bring his A game on October 26th in, at the O2 Arena, live at Sky Box Office. He knows this is his opportunity to to show the world he belongs at that level. He's come close many times before, but he's just just missed out on the big one. And you know, he's, he's not, he, as he's not leaving any stones unturned here in the gym. And he'll bring out the very, very best um, in himself on the fight night, particularly if there's a, a good opponent across the ring for him.